What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with episodes three and four of Kuroko no Basket. Now, remember, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, all that is available on Patreon. Links are down in the description down below. Don't forget to check out the Twitch so you can watch live with us as well. Great community, great vibes. Don't forget to follow the other social medias Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Let's hop into this Kuroko no Basket episode three right now. This one's called "It's Better If I Can't Win." I don't know if I agree. We'll we'll, we'll find out. Kaijo Private High School. Our school is Seirin. So, oh, Kaijo is theirs. Yes, this is where Kisei goes to school. Damn, this is a nice school. I can't lie. It's like going to Shiro Torizawa. Talk about a pretty boy. This dude is a good looking dude. Hey, yo. Ooh. He's like, you figured me out. Okay, Mr. Petty Boy. We wouldn't have it any other way. Damn. I see. I see. <laughs> so that's why they're only using half court instead of the full court. That's ass. <laughs> We're going against the regulars, though. We got a fire lit under us now, though. That is insulting for sure. They think you're buns. He's like, I wanted to show off. <laughs> Damn, he just wants to make it a competition. Is Are they really this good? <laughs> yeah, that's our goal. Let's start winning so we can go against Kise, because right now we're being disrespected. Okay, okay. And now he's using that against us as well. So we're gonna beat your ass. Let's do it. He's like, don't worry about us, buddy. Get ready. <laughs> no, no one ever notices him. They're like, wait, we only got four here. Where's the... Oh, sh... Kagami's been pretty... I love her built-in scout. Scouter. I love it. She's like, damn, their numbers are higher than ours. This does not look good. And we got numbers kind of kerfluffled. Yeah, they do play inter, inter high every time. It's a good question. Thankfully, this is our first practice game, though. This is what we're here to gather that kind of info. Wow, Kagami lost hip off? That's how you know this is going to be a crazy one. You can see how fast that was because you can still see the after image of that ball. How is he going to pass it? Oh, beautiful. First point us. <laughs> you thought... It is kind of an older hoop, but damn. This thing is bigger than I thought. I haven't seen it this close. We have to play full court. <laughs> yeah, you're pissed. Oh, they're bringing down the good ones. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's a good question. No, you don't you definitely don't have to pay for that. There's no way you broke it in the the duties of your game, you know And key says out Is the voice actor for the glasses dude is that it's I recognize him he's someone from either high key or black clover he sounds like Asahi, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> you gonna tell me he's not Oikawa and this isn't Iwaizumi? That is literally, come on. Kasamatsu? That was fire. 
They're like, wow, maybe these guys aren't fucking slackers. So now they're going to start going hard, too. The OST, man, I tell you. Okay. Oh, under the legs. Great pass. That was a great dunk. Shout out to Aokise. I can't lie. I don't know if I'd be a fangirl, but it would be hype watching practice games. Going to these. Oh, my God. He wanted to break it to be like Kagami. I see. I see. Tit for tat. Let's do it. Ooh. Ooh. That was a clean ass pass. <sighs> Hell yeah. What was that? 16, 17? It was so, so fast paced. I couldn't even see it. It's only been three minutes. Oh my God. We already got over 30 points. There damn near is no defense because we're just so offensively strong, both teams. Oh, I love that little silhouette we get to see of them. Uh, can't wait to see the rest of them. I love the way they animate his passes sometimes. Like, it's literally just a flash of light. This in the direction, you know? Going for the fadeaway shot. He's got some hops if he fucking was able to block that. And then he did the same exact thing. Beautiful. He's got the sharring gun. Get into his head a little mentally. Yeah. They'll be just in literally just them two damn near playing a 1v1. They got some valid observations. We're down by three. <laughs> that is a valid point. This is only a five minutes of gameplay. This guy's voice actor is a good voice actor. He's intense. This guy was my coach. I'd be scared as shit. <laughs> He's like, see, I've been telling you, right? We got some observations coming out. Okay, what are you thinking, Kuroko? What would that be? You're tired. Yeah. And he's one of the key defining factors of this team. Look at them. They're shook like damn. Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah, I mean, he only, he's able to get in those pinpoint positions because of his great observation skills, you know? Yeah, that is very true. Well, that's kind of common sense. The more tired you get, the more effective his ace in the hole, the less effective it's going to be. Come on. Didn't even let her answer. Man to man to zone. Okay. See, I know the basics of basketball, but I don't know a lot of the details. So obviously man to man's like from going from one on one defense to offense to uh defending certain areas and probably inside the paint, stuff like that, just stopping him from being able to go in, yep. But that does leave the outside open, you know. Wide open bucket for a three, you hate to see it. Defense. All right, sees Kuroko open. That was actually a good steal from Kaijo. I can't lie. I hate toilet bowl shots like that, but it went in. Yeah, they're starting to get more of a lead, gain some more momentum. Ours is diminishing fast. That was a good pass. Also a good pass. If he blocks this, I... Oh, oh yeah, yeah, he did block that. That's insane. It is a heavily dependent on that. I understand that, but as someone who's seen some another sports anime, that's not everything. I've seen some short people stand out in a in a sport of tall people, you know. <laughs> He's like, with one look at my Sharingan, I'll copy that bitch and make it better. This music so far is fantastic. And is this where the title comes in? Maybe it's better if I don't win. Maybe it's better if I lose. I don't know. America. <laughs> a 
Life is all about overcoming those obstacles. Okay. It's better if I can't win. That's what I like to hear. Okay. He's a natural born counter. Your Sharingan won't work if you don't see us do the thing we're doing. Come on, Kuroko. Oh, is this where it's ending? Okay, okay. I'm hype. Alright, on to episode 4. This one's called Take Care of the Counterattack. Let's do it. Everyone's in utter shock. Okay, we'll see this in the second quarter. Shout out to those guys cleaning the court. They don't get enough appreciation. Yeah. For our first game, and our, they were expecting us to get shat on. Yeah, we're definitely doing better than they thought, at least. Gotta get these fundamentals up. That is true. Rebounds, especially if you're taller, should be a given. Of course he does. <laughs> Take care of the counterattack. That's the title of this episode. Here we go. We got our boys on the bench giving us what support they can. I respect them. I appreciate them. All right. Take care of the counterattack. Let's see it. Already some good offense out of, out of Kaijo. Good rebuttals from us. That was a good screen. Into a good shot. We're down 10 now. We're starting to lose our... Starting to lose some more. Right? Oh, He's doing a fucking Kuroko style pass. And he passed it to Kuroko. Who also passed it beautifully. What, back to him? Oh, 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 to get him focused on, yep. Get his eyes off him for just a second. That's all we need. That was well played. But we need to do so many more of those to be able to catch up, you know? That's the scary part. Won't work this time. But then Kuroko is going to take it to the court. Oh, he's passing it to someone else who will take it to the court. Yep. Yeah, we're making some assists right here. That was a 3-2. That was great. Right? It's a whole different ballgame now. And now we're weaving them in the middle so we can do the him. We can go back to someone else. Go back. You know, it's like options have been exponentially increased. I like it. I like it. And, yep. Lynchpin. I like it. <laughs> this happens though with a newly formed squad you know there's gonna be some coordination issues the music can go from such a heavy guitar to such an emotional piano too i love it as a team all right literally what i was just talking about Piano to this heavy ass guitar. I love this. So, as long as they get through the second quarter, they're in the clear. But, Kagami says. Oh, they're switching man to man. <laughs> right? I love these colored backgrounds. So simple, yet. Yeah. I just love the saturation. I love the color. I'm curious. Can he? It really doesn't seem like he can, but then Kagami comes for the backup. What are they going to do? Now their teamwork for distraction for some... <laughs> yeah, that the, the second of hesitation has been costing you. Playing some mind games in here. Mind games mixed with strategy. I like it. All right. He's like, uh, Kuroko's on me. Oh, wait, no, Kagami's on me. Oh, he already came from behind. You know what you know? Pause. Hey, yo. Uh, he does have range, though. Not the tip off of Kuroko's head. <laughs> the boost off. Talk about a foul. Talk about a technical. Oh, damn. That was a hit hit. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, you're out of the game, which sucks. You are our key star. 
Yeah. Yep. I don't think uh, Kisa did it on purpose at all. He was just in the heat of the moment, but that does suck. Yeah, we got to work with the cards we're dealt, sadly. Oh. Now, he is very... He's very much like Daichi. He, when he gets serious, you don't fuck with him. Okay. I, I, that's, what I was, that's why they're your captain. Because when you're live, when you're backed against a wall, these are your anchors. You rely on this dude. And they always pull through. That's why they're the captain. I always fuck with captains like this, man. Come on. That was a good screen. Hyuga Junpei. Okay, we're getting some of the second years. Izuki. I didn't even get his name for that long. Come on, man. Mitobe Rinosuke. Kogane Shinji. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Horoscope. Uh, I don't like people who are such a fan of astrology like that. He's got colored hair, though, so he's insane. We're already seeing another generation of miracles. He's got colored hair, so he's insane. <laughs> and he's being he's being driven. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, we're only down four? I get it. Don't lose faith, though. We were just talking about how you never get up. He fidgeted back there when you said that. Hey. If he needs to fight through some pain, he will. This man seems like an icon. And he's up and at him. <laughs> Ohio, like he just woke up. He's got his own personal reasons why he's got to keep going. He's not going to let an injury stop him. It is dangerous and risky because he shouldn't push it off too hard. But I firmly agree. Yep. She's, she's playing it like a good coach should. Welcome back, buddy. Hopefully he says something nice. Let's go. Into the thick of this dope-ass game. That was a good shot. Junpei. Good dunk by Kisei. I gotta, I gotta start remembering all the names. It's gonna take me a few episodes, but I'm gonna get better at it. That was a great pass. Right pass, Kisei. Slam that shit. Woo! 80 to 82, fourth quarter. That man's shots are always on point when he gets serious, right? When he needs to clutch up. That's, what, that's why he's the captain right there. Trust him. Come on. You guys underestimated us too much. Yes, let's keep going. We can actually win this. The song? We can't do it. And they feel the presence of another one coming, huh? Wait. This man went ultra instinct. This man said, not today. The way they animated that was honestly insane. I fucked with that. When you back a character like him into the wall, they will unleash some shit. Now we're ending this off just like we started it out. Super fast pace, back and forth, tit for tat. Let's do it. Good dunk. Good shot. 91, 93. This would be so exhausting. It's a great workout, though. 20 seconds left. Those resilient bastards. What's that? It's a simple strategy that will only work once. So if there's ever a time to do it, now is the time. This is anime time. It's only been half a second. Good block out of nowhere by the man Kagami. Good catch. Good throw. Back to Kuroko. Yeah, he's going to think he's going to pass it back. But what is Kuroko going to actually do? My man actually shot it. I know that's the only thing they would never expect him to do. If he actually makes this. An alley oop. Oh my god. That makes so much more sense than risking it 
on my man Kuroko, but he says immediate reaction speed is insane. Oh, this man's towering. I know, this man is towering. That man is damn near floating. I have to score a buzzer beater. And it's ending right now. We got it too, against another generation of miracles. We won. Wow! Whoa! It ends like that too? Don't just hit me out of nowhere like that. Talk about some episodes. That was such a, that was all purely a practice match between us and Kaijo, which I don't, like I said, I apologize to anyone who gets upset between me comparing this to Haikyuu. I only do that in the best of intentions. Haikyuu was one of my favorite anime of all time. It made me have a passion for sports anime. So when I say that how like we were, we beat Oikawa, I don't even know. I don't even remember if we beat Oikawa off, off rip. But I was just shocked that we did it because I love this kind of practice. Get a sense of the power scaling. Get a sense of where we are, where we could be. It's always a great thing to do. It's a great way to start it off. We had some great teamwork. Already had an injury. I'm sure we're going to have some crazy moments, some crazy injuries, some crazy downs and some ups. But <laughs> he say that animated part for him was insane. That animated part for Kuroko was insane at the end there. I love how not only is it animated very well, but it's very unique. Like I... Like, like when Kuroko did that last shot, but it was an alley-oop, it had like the blue bubbles that like it was insane. And I love the way when he passed it, it's just like a, a flashing beam of light. You know, it's actually really well done. I need to know when this anime was made. Like, how old is it? it can't be super old, can it? But overall, thoroughly enjoyed these episodes. I, OST, I gotta, can't lie. Like a lot of it so far is great. OST is probably my favorite part of the show so far. OSC has been phenomenal. Like between the opening, the ending, and the actual songs that play, all I can say so far. I am hyped to get in these episodes. Hopefully, you guys are as well. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Check out that Patreon for early access, full length. Check out that Twitch for full length, early access as well. Check out the other social medias. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out.